For this, this is the final matchup, but this is not a disrespect to Soul of Soy. They've done really, really well, but I've been on this ride from the start. I just might as well go on to the end. That's true. Well, I did say that I did like Soul of Soy's uh, <laughs> I mean, emblem as a team. I mean, look at that thing. <laughs> it's 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 named Soul of Soy, so I'm, I'm assuming that thing is something that Tofu is made That's out of. That's a soybean. That's a it's soybean. soybean. There we go. Yeah, but you know, for some reason, I've never seen that. a soybean before, <laughs> but right now I'm happy that I'm seeing Soul of Soy show that to me. It's educational and also entertaining because they're such a good team as well. <laughs> All right. Bankun Sasa going with his usual player, Akira Sendo. Ikaku changing up. Last time he played Urosumik. This time it's he's playing Akagi, but Mr. Mushroom and New going with that combination of Kazushi and Soul all changing there. Mint is going with Uozumi and Hiroaki sticking with Fluke TMP. Hmm. This is something that we've probably seen as well from their end, right? Bunkum mm -hmm. Sass really does love to use the, the ace players, but that doesn't mean that they're mm -hmm. not going to supplement it with, um, let's say, this secondary shooter that can really put pressure around the perimeter as well. And having Hiroaki is definitely just the, the right pick for Soul of Soy here. So now we're just waiting for the first game to begin. It is going to be really spicy on this one here, uh, TK. For now. Sure. Here we go. Grand Finals, guys! Let's get it on! Put your... Let's your, do this! Support your... Which team you want to win in the chat. I mean, let's let's make it simple. Hashtag Soul of Soy win. Hashtag Hold him win in the chat right now. Drop it on, guys. Game number one for the Grand Finals here in our tournament begins. With the first possession, big block to start the game by Mint for Soul of Soy. Soul of Soy playing in a bit of their home court. Since they are full real Nan team, but another block on Ikaku's end this time. Both teams is going straight on the defense aggressively. Wow, that was such a just a flamboyant shot, to say at the least. Able to connect it and hold him. Starts it off strong with a two. So if Soy does have, of course, Bunking Sass, who we always feel is the man oh, to make oh, the shots happen, and he made it happen with that first one. Uh, it's a combination of crossovers and then double pumping into that layup. Sweet, sweet moves. For Soul Soy. Right back at you, they say. Oof. Just finding that, that that slight bit of opening and able to convert. That's what we want to see right now from Hold'em. And they haven't really stopped at all coming up to this grand finals here. Definitely showing us how deadly they can be. Mr. Mushroom sprouts ah. from the ground. And my goodness, he is sprouting beautifully here. Four points already procured as an advantage up against Soul of Soy. Yeah, and he oh. also was the one that got the steal leading into that, but answer by Bankum Sas. For Soul of Soy, we're having a great matchup between these two players right now. My just, uh, that was a broken ankle right there. My goodness, you gotta go to the doctor because that ankle is broke. Anyways, a nice little pass there. Overshot. Still able to get the ball back as Akagi is just so aggressive. But oh. you know what? That big gorilla cannot do anything unless Bonkoksas is up to play. And so much ball dribbling coming out from this man. But still able to pinpoint him. Noob really does or is able to just go around him. My goodness, that's so quick. Left and right up to the very edge of the board. Still able to connect 6-6. Six to six. A clock counting down. Doesn't matter to Bonkoksas. Time up. We're back at square one. Between double teams in the grand final. Wow, grand final start. Definitely 17 or a couple of seconds on that shot clock. Reset already. Backs it back up. Was a little bit afraid of what's going to happen there with the block coming out from Fluke TNP and almost gets swiped out as well by Mint. Really aggressively oh, done. And this is just like, how are you going to be able to score oh. when everybody is just able to slap the ball away twice in a row? Hold him. What can they do? Great defense there by Zol So now they have a chance to take the lead. Ultimate by Bantu Zas dunks it in. And now they're up ahead looking for first blood in this grand final. That 
slight little flick of the wrist, I think, really does kind of um, reduce the effectivity of the uh, uh, the animation for blocking by Ikaku there. I'm talking about Bunkung Sass's yeah. dunk. In any case, though, they do have the advantage. Plenty of time to get back into this one. An interfered shot, but not blocked. So it's gonna connect and hold him right back at you. Bunkung Sass already used his ultimate there. It's still not really a big lead. I mean, no lead at all, to be more specific. Green light also activated. Wide open shot for the three. Not gonna work. Oh! So it's still oh there. Was a, they almost had the shot to go up ahead, but blocked once again by Hold'em. So, so we're looking for the opening layup. Not take it. Ultimate. And blocked at the rim by Ikaku stepping up. And an 18 second violation. We're still tied here with one minute to go. And hold on with possession. Green Lantern quickly to knock up those two points. Oh, and it's just going back and forth after right. Are we playing basketball or are we playing volleyball? Because there's so many blocks that we're <laughs> seeing here with all these high flyers. I'm kidding, guys. I didn't mean to offend or anything, but that was just so much jumping, so much blocking coming out from both of these teams. And boy, here comes the Gorilla Dunk! Coming out yeah. and the advantage for Holden. Finally, four points above, four point lead rather. As you mentioned, these teams like to keep that ultimate late in the game, and it's giving them a big advantage of four points here with three seconds left to go. But it's also inching in a bit closer. So you think he get the defensive possession? Already gonna be able to do this though. There's a lot of time being uh, being wasted right now by Hold'em as they know that they have the advantage here, but they're still wanting to get more of the lead. Able to pick up the ball. They need to make a three point and then a steal and maybe something to procure here. But that first game is looking mighty fine, juicy for Hold'em as the ball is being thrown around by Soul of Soy. Still, they have to procure a point right now. It's gonna get blocked already. Not gonna oh! happen. And game one, Hold'em, take it. Oh, that game was worthy of a start of the grand final. Bakumsas had the chance there to tie the game up at the last second, but an ultimate block just to give them the win here in the first game. Ah, what a great start to this grand final of the Champion Cup, Asurai. What great start indeed. That was so good. Stats are already here. Check it out. I'm pretty sure we're gonna see like double digits maybe in overall blockings. Uh, <laughs> I mean overall, like everybody. Because there were so yeah. many blockings.